Hi, it's Jiro again today, back with another video. In this video, we're going to be looking at testing Bayonetta 2 on some new point, uh, sorry, some new version of 1.1.13.2. And we are going to be streaming it from a gaming laptop to my Sony Xperia XZ uh, smartphone using the Moonlight APK app over Vodafone 4G. So well, let's get into it.
And there you go. It's um, it's it's just something to do with the shader cache. I haven't played this one. Um, I've just noticed something. Uh, my apologies. It's not Samu one point one three point two. It's Samu one point one. Sorry, one point one one point three. Um, so I do apologise. It's um, I believe I knew something. I was just thinking there as I was playing. Um, some it crashes on some point one one point three. Uh, sorry, one point one three point two. That's why this uh, version still, uh, still pretty good. Some people ask me, just because they bring out a new Samu version doesn't mean it's always going to be better. It could be worse for some games. That's why Samu, uh, one point one one point three is probably a good, probably the best version for uh, Mario Kart for your standard games. I'm going to test out a breath of the wild and see what it's like on Samu one point one point three, and just see what it is look like what it uh, looks like. Um, I played. I played it on semi point one, uh, semi point one, point one three point two. I want to see what it was like on this version. So, as you can see, it looks pretty good. There's a couple of starters I still do with the shader cast because I, I need to get a shader cast for this. Um, but apart from that, it's pretty good to stream. I was getting into that then because I do like I do enjoy this game. So, uh, like, comment, subscribe, uh, ask a question, and. And I'll get back to you as soon as I can. So I shall see you in the next video. Bye for now.